Today, we are counting down the world's 10 most extreme demolitions. Think 19 high-rises collapsing in 10 seconds is impressive. That only ranks as number 10. We are covering everything from a world record blast that leveled four 164 meter skyscrapers at once in the United Arab Emirates to America's most embarrassing demolition, a stadium that simply refused to fall on the first try. These operations are more than just clearing rubble. They erase landmarks, reshape entire ecosystems, and even involve entering deadly radiation zones. The number one spot is a project so dangerous, it still makes world powers sweat. Which one do you think deserves the top spot? Let me know your ranking in the comments below. Top 10. The 19 Building Mass Demolition In the global history of explosive engineering, the 2017 demolition of 19 buildings in Wuhan's Binjiang Business District stands as a technical marvel. In a breathtaking 10 seconds, 19 high-rise buildings collapsed simultaneously, safely, and precisely. This combination of scale, density, and speed is rarely seen. The challenge was immense. The buildings were extremely close to each other, with the tallest exceeding 18 stories, all made of complex reinforced concrete. Engineers had to ensure each structure fell exactly as planned to prevent catastrophic collisions and protect the surrounding area from flying debris. This required over 120,000 drill holes and nearly 5 tons of explosives, all placed at critical structural points. The team employed a millisecond-level delay detonation technique. This allowed all 19 buildings to explode almost at the same time, but with microscopic time gaps between them. This clever timing prevented the shockwaves from amplifying, ensuring an orderly and safe collapse. While most demolitions rely on wide buffer zones and phased blasts, the Wuhan project succeeded in an extremely confined space, a true testament to modern engineering. Top 9. The World's Tallest Building Demolition Imagine a single blast capable of destroying four skyscrapers, each soaring over 160 meters tall. This isn't theoretical. It's exactly what happened in 2020 at the Mina Plaza demolition in Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates. This event set the Guinness World Record for the tallest building complex ever demolished in a controlled explosion. The difficulty wasn't just the sheer height, which was equivalent to stacking over 200 residential floors. The true challenge was the proximity. The four towers stood only a few meters apart. The demolition required absolute millisecond-level precision to ensure they all collapsed safely and simultaneously, without a single piece falling off-track and causing a chain reaction disaster. Engineers spent months running 3D simulations to map the fall, using over 300 kilograms of explosives. On demolition day, surrounded by a busy urban center, the four concrete giants came down in a perfectly orchestrated, inward collapse that looked more like a choreographed dance than a demolition. Top 8. The Most Stubborn Demolition in History If demolition is a contest of technology versus physics, the Pontiac Silverdome blast is its most dramatic chapter. It didn't just collapse, it refused to fall on the first try, forcing the engineers to try again. This incident completely redefined the idea of a failed demolition. The story begins on the 3rd of December 2017, in a suburb of Detroit, Michigan. The Silverdome, former 80,000-seat home of the National Football League's Detroit Lions, was set to be demolished. National media and hundreds of locals gathered to watch the 4-0-year-old stadium disappear. The countdown finished, the explosives detonated, and a huge cloud of smoke erupted. But when the smoke cleared, the stadium was… still standing. The engineering company, Atomo, explained that 10% of the detonators had failed to fire, leaving the core structure intact. The stadium's defiance immediately went viral, earning it the nickname the Stubborn Dome. Engineers didn't take this failure lightly. The next day, they returned with more than triple the explosives, increasing the load from 300 pounds to 1,000 pounds. On December 4, the second blast went off. This time, the Silver Dome finally surrendered, and the massive ring collapsed, officially ending the landmark's long-running saga. Top 7. The Morandi Bridge Demolition a single, massive explosion and two colossal bridge towers are sliced clean at their base. Tens of thousands of tons of concrete plummet to the ground, sending a tidal wave of dust and mist surging into the air. This wasn't a movie special effect, 
It was the 2019 demolition of the remaining sections of Italy's Morandi Bridge in Genoa. This blast was the final, necessary chapter in a national tragedy. The original bridge, an advanced structure from 1,967, had partially collapsed in 2018, killing 43 people. Two four five-meter tall towers, piers 10 and 11, were left standing, looming precariously over railways, highways, and dense residential neighborhoods. Engineers spent months planning the operation, using 550 kilograms of explosives. The goal was to use precision time charges to make the towers kneel, folding at their base to collapse perfectly within the tiny, controlled zone. The blast itself lasted only six seconds, but the preparations required evacuating 3,500 residents and setting up dozens of high-pressure water cannons to suppress the dust. It remains a classic example of high-risk demolition, valued not for its size, but for the incredible precision required in the heart of a city. Top 6. The 3.5-kilometer overpass demolition If the Italian bridge blast was impressive, this next one redefines the meaning of an urban spectacle. On the night of the 18th of May 2013, in Wuhan, China, an entire concrete overpass measuring 3,476.5 meters long was precisely erased from the city map in just 26 seconds. From the air, it looked like a cement dragon running through the city was ignited all at once, instantly collapsing. This was China's longest-ever concrete bridge demolition, and one of the world's only successful blasts of such a long, continuous structure in a dense urban core. The overpass was located on a main thoroughfare in Wuhan's economic and technological development zone, surrounded by apartment buildings and complex utility lines. The operation demanded absolute perfection, zero flying debris and zero deviation in the collapse. To achieve this, engineers drilled over 5,000 holes, packing them with nearly one ton of explosives. Using a segmented directional collapse technique, they essentially choreographed the bridge's fall. At 10 p.m., the signal was given. The entire 3.5-kilometer structure fell in on itself in a perfectly timed sequence, an event described as an urban steel ballet. Top 5. The Condit Dam Eco Restoration If blasting bridges is urban surgery, then demolishing the Condit Dam was a massive ecological operation. Built in 1913 on the White Salmon River in Washington State, the three four-meter high dam was a century-old relic. It no longer served a vital power generation role, but it was still doing one thing very effectively, blocking the migration routes of precious Pacific salmon. In 2011, after long assessments, the decision was made to remove it. The goal was not just demolition, it was to restore the river's natural flow and revive its entire ecosystem. This was incredibly difficult. The structure contained over 15,000 cubic meters of concrete. A poorly controlled blast could release a century's worth of trapped silt, devastating the fragile spawning grounds downstream. Using precision-timed explosives, engineers blasted a hole in the dam's base, allowing the river to burst through in a spectacular torrent. The results were almost immediate. Less than a year after the demolition, the number of returning salmon in that section of the river surged by nearly 300% a stunning victory for ecological restoration. Top 4. The St. John's River Power Park Blast At the St. John's River Power Park in Jacksonville, Florida, a massive demolition marked the end of an era for traditional coal power. As energy structures shifted toward cleaner alternatives, the aging plant, with its towering chimneys and massive boiler units, became obsolete. The facilities were too old to meet modern environmental standards, and the decision was made to clear the land. Though the chimneys stood at only about 198 feet, or 60 meters, the site was dangerously close to residential areas and critical infrastructure, demanding extreme precision. The contractor, Controlled Demolition Incorporated, used advanced techniques, placing 600 kilograms of explosives and over 600 detonators at key structural points. On the 19th of July, 2019, the old facility met its end. The blast was part of a larger decommissioning project that began in 2018 with the demolition of two massive cooling towers. In just a few seconds, the chimneys and boilers collapsed in a perfectly controlled implosion, a powerful symbol of the ongoing transition to greener energy. Top 3. The Eggboro Cooling Towers Demolition On the industrial plains of North Yorkshire, United Kingdom, four concrete giants, each standing 90 meters high, collapsed in a perfectly timed explosion. 
This wasn't an act of war, but a meticulously planned demolition marking the official end of the United Kingdom's traditional coal power era. The Eggborough Power Station, built in the 1,960 seconds, was once a symbol of national energy, providing electricity to over two million homes. Its eight iconic cooling towers, resembling giant cups, were a staple of the British industrial landscape. However, as the UK shifted to decarbonize its energy grid, the plant was officially decommissioned. The task fell to DSM demolition. They chose to demolish four of the towers at once, each containing 20,000 cubic meters of concrete. The team used high-energy explosives placed in hundreds of drill holes, all controlled by millisecond-level delays. This ensured the towers would fall in a predetermined direction, preventing them from colliding. Notably, the circular structure of cooling towers makes them incredibly stable and far more complex to demolish than a skyscraper. On the morning of the 1st of August 2021, thousands gathered to watch. The blast was heard, and seconds later, the four towers folded and collapsed, disappearing into a massive cloud of dust, symbolizing the final, emotional end of an industrial age. Top 2. The 15 Abandoned Towers Demolition On the 27th of August 2021, the city of Kunming, China, witnessed an unprecedented urban clearing. In a single, thundering blast, 15 massive abandoned high-rises were brought to the ground. This was the Liang New City Project, a development that had stalled for years due to a broken capital chain, leaving a massive scar on the city's landscape. This wasn't just about clearing rubble. It was about erasing 4.5 billion yuan, or over 700 million US dollars in debt, and unlocking a huge tract of prime real estate for urban renewal. The demolition was a feat of extreme precision. It required 5.6 tons of explosives placed in 85,000 separate blast points. The engineering team used a millisecond delay blasting technique, forcing all 15 towers to collapse in a predetermined sequence, like a row of giant dominoes. An error of even 0.1 seconds could have caused a chain reaction disaster. To ensure safety, over 5,300 people were evacuated from the surrounding area. Top 1. The Chernobyl Death Zone Decommission If you think a skyscraper collapsing is impressive, you haven't seen humanity's ultimate challenge – dismantling a death core. We are in northern Ukraine, at the Chernobyl Nuclear Power Plant. In 1986, an explosion tore apart Reactor 4, releasing the radiation equivalent of 400 Hiroshima bombs, becoming the worst nuclear disaster in history. Its decommissioning is, without question, the most dangerous and complex demolition project ever attempted. This isn't a normal construction site, it is a radiation hell. The melted core, or corium, still emits radiation so intense at times over 10,000 Roentgens per hour that approaching it for even one minute means certain death. Direct human operation is impossible. The work relies entirely on remote-controlled robots, laser-cutting arms, and specialized drones. But the most stunning part is that the crumbling original shelter could no longer hold back the radiation. So, humanity built the largest movable structure in history, the new safe confinement. This colossal arch stands 108 meters high, 165 meters long, and weighs 36,000 tons, sliding over the entire reactor. This isn't a two-minute blast, it's a 100-year war, with full decommissioning not expected until 2065. It's not just demolition, it's the taming of a nuclear monster. Which of these 10 most extreme demolitions shocked you the most? Leave a comment and let me know. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much. See you again.